So in this section, we're going to talk about um, young puppies and older dogs. As I do know, it's really common for people to get a puppy before their older dog passes away. Um, the way I like to think about it is imagine young children and they go and visit their grandparents. Uh, their grandparents are more than happy to see them and very welcome, welcoming. But even your grandparents, like the older dog, do have their, their limits. They haven't got the same kind of energy that a young puppy he has so this is where you need to step in as new pet parents and take over the supervision of your young puppies so if you see the other dog giving the signals that they've had enough it might be low growls they might be starting to pin the puppy on the floor they might be turning their bodies away trying to avoid any interaction and the young puppy just isn't getting it this is where you need to step in and remove your young puppy from the situation Never tell the older middle-aged dog off. They are just trying their best to communicate that they've reached their, their limit. Generally, um, other dogs will tolerate puppies' playfulness um, roughly until about the age of seven to nine months because before this stage, uh, your puppies have this beautiful puppy smell. Around about seven to nine months, the hormones will kick in and that starts a whole new stage of um dog personality changes um but this is where the, your older dogs and your puppies haven't learned some polite manners by then usually this is when i get called in because issues are starting to surface so the moral of this story is supervise your puppy take them away um before things escalate too far and gradually they will learn to um reduce their play limit because they're going to read the signals from the other dog that they get into the limit and they've had enough